Hey, welcome everybody. My name is Ray. Welcome for part two, seven years from now. So, we are start the chapter three at Haruto's room. So yeah, Haruto. <sighs> I couldn't find anything related to my memories. So yeah, before that, the Haruto is about is just arrive here at this town and try to find out about his memory from seven years ago. He made a promise to this girl that he don't remember the name. Her name is. So he come here to the town to figure out about the memory. He come to hospital. That he think. He ever be there with this girl named Aoi And he somehow heard about the accident that happened in the hospital Which is a which is also happened seven years ago Well, that totally give me a goosebump when I read about it So, yeah Okay, sorry guys, let's continue that's all man had to go for his checkup right after. Accident, huh? I wonder if it's something to do with my memory loss. Oh, I forgot to go to Dr. Ichiki place. I could go now. Oh wait, it's too late. I will go tomorrow morning. The next day. March 30, Tuesday. Oh no, I sleep in. I slept in. S sleep. Let's go quick. We still cannot enter this room. Uh. Let's go out. Let's talk to this girl. I wonder what they use that pipe for. Why are you always here? <laughs> Are you stalking me? <laughs> uh, Tuesday. <laughs> well, complain until it come to <laughs> Friday night. Right here. Huh? You're close today. What to do now? I guess I could go to the hospital and find out about the accident. Straight to the hospital. That nurse. Oh, you that kid from yesterday. It's Haruto. Right, Haruto, what's bring you here today? Asking around again. I saw you talking to a lot of people yesterday. Yeah, I was looking for people who knew about the hospital past. But my older sister was nurse at this hospital and oh, but it is fine. I was this time I'm looking for answer about accident seven years ago. Accident? Yeah. Will you know anything about it? Oh, but I guess you are busy with work. It's okay. I just finished my shift and was about to head home. Anyway, the accident seven years ago, huh? What do you want to know about it? Well... Somebody interrupt me again. God see, I want to know what happened seven years ago. You're hard to write. Long time no see. It's been seven... No, eight years. Uh, um, why you don't let you know me? A friend of you? I guess I take my leave then. See you next time. For heaven's sake, interrupt, interrupt me again. First the painter, now you. <clears throat> take a sip of water. Why are you? all climb up. I'm really sorry, but I don't remember you. What? What? My uh, memories are a bit missing in a place. Are you serious? Yeah. Um, can I ask you a question? What's your name? I'm Riku. Riku Imaki. Riku? I think I heard of it before. 
So I think you and I were friends. You, um, sorry. Don't worry. You should. We play here together a lot, though. Oh, really? That's great. I actually been looking for someone who might know me since yesterday, but I didn't have any luck. If it won't be trouble, you do you think you can tell me about the past? Yeah. I guess I could, but before that, why don't we grab a bite? Yeah, sure. Huh? Yeah, sure. I was just starting to get hungry as well. Well, let's go to the shop. They have some delicious fried rice there. Mm, fried rice. Um, sedap. Um, sedap ni. Tak apa, aku makan nasi lemak kali ni. Cool. Actually, they just buy some rice ball or something from the canteen. I don't have much on me anyway. Okay, let's go there then. So, what do you want to know? Well, I made a promise in the past. And I want to know when and where and with who I made that promise. Hmm. Even if you say that, I'm gonna need some more clue. Hmm. Hmm. Sorry, my bad. <clears throat> I think it was with a girl. I think her name is Aoi. Oh, so you remember Aoi? And you don't remember me. You remember that girl, but you don't remember me. I'm your bros. I'm your bro. Sorry. Then she must be the one you made the promise with. You guys were really close, so... Well, I still don't know where you made the promise, but... So you know about Aoi. Is she still living in this town? Uh, actually... Moved out of the town before, so I'm not sure. I see. Then her content detail, nah, I wouldn't have them. Is it possible that you moved away from this town because of the accident several years ago? Oh, nah. I moved out a bit before that. Then you also wouldn't know much about the accident, huh? I heard that there was a big explosion in the hospital and that's quite a few die. Maybe they rebuilt this place after the explosion? Huh? What are you talking about? I didn't see it myself, but the building the expert was that research center over there, and this building was completely fine. Nothing changed with this building. Huh? What? Oh, I see. Everyone I asked was either new to this town or only began working here recently. So I thought they rebuild this place after it exploded. But I didn't think that so many people will come and go in 7 years. Yeah. It sure has changed too much in just 7 years, to the point that it's strange. Hmm? Hey Rico, can I ask you another question? Why was I admitted to this hospital? Wait up! Now it's my turn to ask you a question, Haruto. What have you been doing until now? Oh, um, I actually been living with my parents although we are related by blood. We've been living in Tokyo but we come to visit here over spring break. Adoptive parent? Since when? Sorry, I don't know the detail. I can't remember much of my life before moving to Tokyo. You didn't ask your parent? Well... I did try once but... Um, don't worry. Anyway, tell your parent name Joe and where they were from. Both of my parents were in companies in Tokyo and I think they originally from this town. Their names are... Wait, why are you asking this anyway? Hey Haruto, you don't really remember anything? And you... Sorry... But I started to record things gradually by being in this town, so... Is that so? Just tell me straight, Reiko, what is going on? God! Playing hide and seek with the information now? God sake, don't do like this to me. I'm lost my mind right here. Then follow me. Let's go for a walk. Have a seat. It's Imaki. Welcome, hotel receptionist. Welcome. This place 
has a familiar smell. Yeah, he Haruto was uh remembering his memory by a famous smell what i seen from a moment when i was playing this game just remembering the his memory by smell there's some smell that nostalgia and recall the memories back somehow it's a good memory somehow sometimes it's not I don't know, but it's good to remember the memories. But sometimes, there are some memories that we hope we just forget. Eh, well, just my opinion. So let's get back to it. What I said last time, I told Kakeru as well. What did he say? He told me not to worry about him and do what I want. I see. Haruto, that's why I decide to go. Keep being good friend with my little bro, would you? Of course, leave him to me. But are you going to be okay moving to a new school? I might be a little scared. Huh? You're the one who worry now. But you will also have a new dad, huh? Don't think about it, my mom, dad, and my new dad, none of them are my family anyway. What do you mean? You know, if I was an adult, I'd take Kakeru to school. Oh, and of course, I'll take you too. Uh huh, am I just a tag along? But yeah, you have to go to school, Riku, since you are not actually ill. But that's the same with Kakeru and I and the others. Yeah. That's true. Sorry. I guess you are leaving, huh? Hmm. But are you fine with that? There is certain someone who you won't be able to meet anymore. What, what are you talking about? Jeez, don't play dumb. Sh shut up. It's fine. Huh? But I guess I will be a bit late, a bit lonely. I will be. I will come back definitely. Well, when you do, let's go and eat fried rice, the one with sauce on top. Oh yeah, bravery fried rice. Yeah, that one. Mm, but you're a real gluten, so I feel like you will go and eat it by yourself before that. I won. Really? Yeah. Hmm, I wonder. Well, I'll be looking forward to it. We'll have to make sure we won't forget. I will never forget it. It's a promise. Yeah, a promise. I swear on it. Great, I swear on it too. So, pinky promise? Mm, wait a minute. Are we promising that you will come back or is it the... Of course, it's the food. <laughs> <laughs> okay, right, got it. The fried rice. That was me and Riku. What's wrong? Let's go. Oi, are you asleep? Uh, um, he's my little bro. You mean Kakeru? You remember him? Yeah, I had a flashback just as we walked into this building. I see. He's asleep. Yeah, recently he's sleeping a lot. His early symptom of illness called LMD. LMD? Yeah, once the LMD really does show up, you only have around two years to live. Hey Haruto, what do you think? Is there any treatment? There's none. God sick. Sad but it's coming. <laughs> Let's go back. Oh. <laughs> just just like that. 
Yo, Kakeru. Where's LMD? Is this a freezer? Why you have a freezer and TV? You don't even wake up. You do have a heater too. And a flower. Wait, somehow I cannot go. Uh, okay, I can. Hmm. Let's get up. Oh, let's follow him. Hey, Haruto. Being here remind me of thing. We used to play around here a lot. Me, you, and Kakeru. Like that wall there, it must still have all drawing we did before. Sorry, Ko. I don't remember. You used to always want to go to the garden, saying that you want fresh air. I did. Hey, Rick. Oi, Haruto. You asked me about our, right? Yeah, yeah, I did. What about she died seven years ago? What? Who exactly are you? Oh, heaven sake. I always die. Oh my god. No. So we are uh, start chapter four for now. So let me change the okay. That's good. Riku. Riku. <clears throat> Sorry. Forget about it. Hey, are you coming to hospital tomorrow? Uh, yeah. That was my plan. I see. I'll be waiting at where we first met. Okay. See you tomorrow. Okay, we need to okay this side here. <sighs> I should sleep. The next day, March thirty one, Wednesday. So there's nothing we can interact here. So let's go down. That. Dad and mom is not home, so let's go up. I should go to clinic today for sure. Let's go to the clinic. Okay, stalker, what are you doing? I wonder why they are facing off a vacant land. You question everything. <laughs> you stalker too. Uh, Wednesday. <laughs> you are a companion for every each day. God sake. Go to the clinic. Yep. Uh, I'm not sick or anything, but could I see the doctor? Oh, you the kid from before. Sorry, but he busy see pressure now. I'll tell him that you come. So, would you mind waiting until the working hour finish? Uh, yeah, sorry. I will come again. I guess I should have come when he's not busy. Let's interact with this guy. Check out patient. I sleep all day yesterday, so now I'm feeling better. Okay. I think Riku will be waiting at the hospital now. But even if I met Riku like this. Mm hmm. What did you, what did you try to mean, Haruto? What did you try to mean? Oh, okay. 
shop stuff. Welcome. Um, this is it. Yo, Rico. <laughs> Yo, you are late. Rico, here you go. Huh? A receipt? I had a fried rice. Oh, you went to get breakfast? Were you that hungry? The fried rice was great. Uh, okay. What's about it? But it was from convenience store, so it was just a normal one. Let's go and eat gravy one together next time. Hard to. Don't tell me you went to eat fried rice just to tell me that. Is that weird? <laughs> <laughs> of course it is. Oh well, next time let's go together. We did promise after all. Yeah. Here we go. I really don't remember much from the past. But bit by bit, I'm starting to recall things and about you. So, yeah, I know, I know. You are you. I'm sorry for saying something weird yesterday. Riku. Hey, by the way. There's something I need your help with. Hmm? Let's go somewhere else. Where? Where? I was telling you yesterday about what happened 7 years ago, right? Yeah, about that accident. Right, and after that, almost everyone who used to be at this hospital is gone. True. I didn't find anyone who was here 7 years ago, but what are you implying? Well, I know why. After the incident 7 years ago, this hospital was des design design <laughs> designated as an advanced medical institution of the area. And by the gathering, the best mind in the profession, they seem to have ended up getting rid of all the old stuff. I see. Except for the head doctor of Kakiru Floor. That's it. He's still here. Why do you think that is? Hmm. Cause he's specialist in something? That's what I thought at first, but around six months ago, we had new trainee doctor join the hospital. Ugh. Okay, my eyes. My god. Okay, <laughs> Dr. Shintani was his name. He was really nice passionate guy and was really friendly with me. He often complained how, work, how waking up early was tough and how hard the, his training was. But then, about two months later, I just happened to overhear Dr. Shintani confront the head doctor in a loud voice. He was shouting, Why are you letting them die? Please show me a document in the room. Why are you hiding them from me? Then the next day, Dr. Shintani disappeared from the hospital. Hey Haruto, don't you think there's reason why Kakeru head doctor is the only one still here? Yeah, it can be a coincidence that Dr. Shintani just disappeared the next day. But shouldn't you try telling this to your parent or other adult? I did. To my parent who abandoned Kakeru? To my professor at uni and to anyone I thought who could help, but nobody did anything. The Tokitsu group, which run the hospital, has a lot of influence. Well, it's not the same as complaining at a family restaurant for that service. Riku, I don't mean to doubt you, but maybe Dr. Shintani was talking about Kaikara when she when he said letting them die. Nah, it was definitely about Kakeru, although there was some part I didn't understand. Kakeru and the other LMD patients are being left to die, was certainly what they were implying. I see. And that's not all of it. Hmm? After that, I was able to track down Dr. Shintani to ask about it. Oh, if that's so, when Dr. Shintani looked at me, what he said was... Who are you? Oh my god. Second goosebump. Dude, second goosebump. <gasps> I 
even say what the God say Am I easily get a goosebump or oh, this story really give me a goosebump? So the progress Okay guys I will end the video for part two here seven years from now so don't forget to subscribe and like for the next part three so bye bye